Hello, this is CJ here. And in this video, I'm going to be talking about how we can extract text from image. Now, the inspiration for this video came from one of my uh, you know, colleagues who works in um, the legal division of my firm. And then he actually wanted to know if there is any application through, uh, through which we can extract the text because they receive a lot of contract information in, um, in as a scanned copy. Now, I was trying to explore a couple of um, applications myself over the last couple of weeks or two, three weeks and have zeroed in on two. One of them actually is a free if you happen to have an Office 365 license or if you have uh, one note. The other one is a bit different. Uh, it's uh, called Snagit. So uh, in this video, I'm going to be talking about these two applications. Now, uh, there are plethora of applications on the internet which, which we can which can actually um, solve this problem of extracting text from image and there are also mobile phone applications as well but of course i cannot go uh, in detail about all the other application as a matter of fact uh, when i download the other applications they uh, invariably ask for my credit card details in order to uh, provide me a three-day trial or four-day trial and i am not too comfortable about that uh, i'm not too comfortable about giving my credit card so let's get started the first thing I'm going to show you is uh, uh, snag it now this application is uh, from the company called TechSmith right and uh, the same company which makes um, a Camtasia studio through which I'm recording this video right now now so let me quickly open text uh, snag it okay All right, so this application has got two different modes and well, the, the application has got a lot of features, but I'm going to be talking mainly about how we can extract images, right? Uh, extract the text from the image. So the two modes I'm talking about is that this is all in one mode, where in all in one mode, you get to, ext uh, you take a, a snapshot and you also take, a, I would say, a scrolling snapshot. So, for example, if a page is big and you don't want to keep taking snapshots, so you can just take one snapshot and keep scrolling down. And let's show you in one of the, um, the PDF documents. So, this is a, a, a scanned copy I found on the internet. Now, I'm going to take a, a snapshot from Snagit, okay, using all-in-one. So when you click on, let me just first choose image only. Okay, so you click on capture and click on this one, right? Now the the most uh, wonderful thing about Snagit is the fact that not only you can take extract content of the image, it can maintain the formatting as it is what you're seeing right now. So if I, uh, this, is a, this is a snapshot. So if I right click on it, click on grab text it will open a new dialog box and this will be very much equal to what the, uh, the text that you're seeing in the same fashion so i'm going to either uh, copy like this or copy let me quickly open a notepad or a word document word all right, so I'm going to paste it like this. So, of course, um, you can reduce the text size if you want to. Just give me one moment. Yep. So, so as you can see, this is very much like this or this document through which the, the image was taken, right? Now I'm going to show you how you can uh, take a, s a scrolling screenshot. So you go back to snag it once again, click on all in one, click on capture, capture something like this text, and then it's going to prompt you to uh, click on the <clears throat> uh, click on the image or click on this one. This will allow you to scan it horizontally as well as vertically. Okay, so once you once you have clicked this, it's going to ask you to start. Press the start button and scrolly, slowly s scroll down, allowing everything in the frame.
I think this is good enough. Now I'm going to stop it and allow it to process. There's going to again open the same dialog box or the box, I would say. And now I am going to grab the text and see if it retains the formatting. As you can see, it has not only uh, grabbed, uh, you know, converted the uh, the image to the text. It has also maintained the formatting, which is a good thing. Now, this particular window can also allow you to fix minor errors, which uh, which may crop up. Like for example, a this one uh, form size. Let me let, let's go back to see. Form size is eight and a half. And out here, it's showing something different. So if you want to correct this thing, you can correct here, like eight and a half. And uh, delete this. And then something other, some other, uh, like this one as well, open ELS if it is uh, something different on the main uh, text. And if it is not, and you're okay with it, just click on copy, open the Word document, and paste it and reduce the text size if you want to uh, okay so yep now this is actually mimicking the the actual format so if you want to kind of move things around you can obviously grab the handle and then, then do it yourself but by and large it copies the text and the formatting as per the original document. Now, if uh, let's go, this is actually snag it. Now I'm going to show you uh, the uh, one note. Now one note it comes uh, free of cost if you have Microsoft 365 or even Microsoft uh, uh, Office. So let me quickly open one note. Oops, one note, and I'm going to delete this. And let me go back, close this. Now this is a scanned image, right? So I'm gonna copy this thing and I'm gonna paste it here. Okay, so this is a scanned image, not a text document, but OneNote allows us to scan, to search to the text. Say for example, if I have to search natural, So it is actually searching in the uh, in the on, in the image. So that is a very neat thing to do, right? So if you have uh, uh, an image, you can copy paste the image in the one node, and then you can just simply start searching. Like for example, uh, form, right? So there are so many forms here, and uh, then anything else like card. Right, so that's that's the beauty of uh, OneNote. Now, if you want to extract the image, uh, extract the text from the image, just right click on it and choose copy text from the picture. Uh, I'm going to go back to Word again, and then I'm going to paste it here. Let's see if it retains the formatting. So, uh, right click and choose this one. Keep source formatting. So, this is how. Uh, Word would interpret it. This is exactly how one note is going to extract the text and paste it in, in Word format. It's not going to retain the the formatting of the original document, but it's going to definitely extract the content. So you may have to kind of uh, use uh, delete key to align all the text together, right? As per the paragraphs, right? But uh, as far as the snack it is concerned, that is. Um, uh, the best part of the application is the fact that, that it can actually uh, extract the content in the same format as the um, the original document. So th that is the uh, um, you know that are two applications: uh, the Snagit as well as the OneNote, which allows you to extract content from the image. I hope you like this video. I really appreciate if you can just click on the like button and the bell icon and subscribe to my channel. Thanks a lot.